Snow crabs are crabs that live in the coldest regions of the North Atlantic and North Pacific Oceans. The name snow crab is taken from the climate of these places, where the water temperature is always below 4 degrees Celsius. This type of crab has a small body, long, thin legs and an orange, light brown or red shell. Snow crab is considered a particularly popular and beloved seafood, originating specifically from Canada, Japan or even Korea and also in Alaskan waters. Snow crab is one of the most popular types of seafood because of its sweet meat, delicious quality and great nutritional value that it brings to consumers. Hello everyone. Today, join me in following the fishermen in the town of Shippigan, New Brunswick, Canada, on a snow crab fishing trip in the North Atlantic Ocean. Before going on a catching trip, fishermen need to carefully prepare fuel and food for the trip because it can last from a few days to a few weeks depending on the purpose and location of the fishing. And equally important are fishing tools, bait, ice to marinate crabs and many other things for catching. Once they reach the catching area, the crab traps will be dropped to the seabed along with two to three bags of bait. Bait is usually made with foods such as fish, shrimp, squid or other odors that attract crabs such as onions, garlic or squid. After the trap is dropped, the bait will lure the crabs into the trap to feed, and the crab cone will prevent the crabs from getting back out. After setting the trap, the fishermen will wait from a few hours to a few days to begin collecting the cages, or the time to collect the cages can be determined based on the fishermen's experience and understanding of how crabs work that area. 
Next is harvesting the results. There are many regulations governing snow crab fishing in Canada. The purpose is to protect snow crabs during their reproductive stages or reduce the risk of overfishing. Crabs that do not reach the minimum size or female crabs that are in the process of reproducing will be released back into the wild. To learn more about these regulations, you can see more in the description. On each crab catching trip like this, fishermen can harvest dozens of tons of quality crabs, which is truly a successful trip. Thank you for taking the time to watch the video. Please subscribe to the channel to watch many interesting videos. Thank you very much.